It's your man KD, aka Handyman, aka the Item Maker, aka Clay Davis, coming to you live, and I got my girl on the line, Risque. What's up, Risque? What's up? What's going on with you? I'm just steady grinding. I hear that. I hear that. You got that hit single out right now. I smell that shit. Yep. Can you tell the listeners about that? Um, it's a song that I made in reference to a relationship that I had, you know, a while back in my life. And I just made the song, um, really to get back at the guy. But, you know, when I made the song, it just took off like crazy. Right, right. I don't hear any names in the song. Do he know you're talking about him? Yeah, he know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you, you pretty much, um, I've been telling people because every time I play it, I start singing it. And, um... I'm not sure if this is where you got it from, but did you cop that line from a uh, baby boy? No. Oh, you did? You know, all women, I don't know if all women do it, but it's something that's been going on way before baby boy. Oh, well, but do you, you know what I'm talking about on baby boy? I know what you're talking about. Okay, okay, so all women do that, huh? I mean, the ones I talk to, yeah. They all think it anyway. Think it, yeah. Yeah, well, hey, that's crazy. That's crazy, I never heard that before. Until I seen that movie, but like I say, when you came out with it, I've, I've been, you know, I've been singing it left and right, and I have been playing it like crazy, especially at the clubs. Cool. And, and all the females feeling it, and the fellas. That's cool. You know, it's a, like I say, it's a hidden song. Um, you got any more information going on with you, where you performing at, or anything like that? Yeah, um, I'll be in Houston, Texas on the 15th. Not Houston, I'll be in Austin, Texas on the 15th. So you're going to be at the court retreat in New Orleans? Yes, I'll be there. Have you ever did one of those? No, I've never um, been to the court retreat. Okay. This will be my first. I am a court DJ, actually, and I've been to the last, uh, I think, last three. Mm -hmm. Since August 06, Atlanta, Miami. Yeah, the last three events I've been to. Okay. I mean, they're they off the chain. I, I try to tell everybody if they haven't been to a court retreat, to get there. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there that Friday and then Saturday I'm flying out to Texas. Oh, yeah. You did say the 15th you had. Oh, where about in Texas, you say? Um, it's kind of a secret right now because the person who wants that I'm performing for, they're very famous and they want to announce it first, so I can't say nothing until they announce it. No, oh, well, I was just asking because I, I lived in Texas 12 years. I just moved to Atlanta actually in 2002 from okay. Dallas, Texas. And uh, what part of uh, Florida you, you represent? I'm in Central Florida. I'm from Bartow, you know, Polk County. Uh, I'm not familiar with the counties. Yeah, it's in Central Florida. It's in between Orlando and Tampa. Okay, because I, I had a partner that just moved from Tampa up to D.C. He was, he's been in Tampa since 91. He actually used to play for the Buccaneers. What up, T-Cub? Oh, okay. So what else going down there? Y'all got um, Smalls down in Tampa, don't you? Yeah, DJ Smalls, he's in Tampa. Mm -hmm. You ever got down with him? Hands up with him? I've been networking with Smalls for some years. He's been, you know, um, receiving my music since Papa Till. And yeah, I've talked to Smalls a lot. Okay, that's good. I know I used to own the store, Must Run Entertainment. And I believe I was one of the first stores to start carrying Smalls back in. Uh, 2002 when he was doing his Street Soldier series before he switched over to the Southern Smoke. Oh, okay. But now he big time. He can't, you know, he can't return to Brother Carl. <laughs> you know how it is. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. It's all good. I still love him. He stays on his grind. He got, you know, I wish him much success. Yeah. And um, so, you got the MySpace going on. You want to say that link again? It's Risque Drama Queen. Alright. Do you get a lot of fans hitting me up on there? Oh yeah, I do. Every day, I'm getting a lot of hits, a lot of traffic coming to my MySpace page. Okay, uh, that'll work. And uh, let me ask you this, uh, what's your next single coming out? Do you know when it's going to be released? Really, I'm working on the next single. Um, 
I'm not working on it, but I have a whole bunch of songs and I'm just trying to pick the single that I want to come out with next. And I don't have a release date because it's like um, the SYD is just now taking off. And we're just trying to focus on that, push that real hard, trying to get the video shot. It's just getting it, um, radio play all over the country. It's also, um, I actually did two record deals for this, this song. And I did a song, um, record deal in the U.S. with Sony Red. And I did a record deal overseas with Universal Europe. So the song is um, actually overseas as well as here. And we just did a deal with Universal Canada so that it can be distributed in Canada. So we just trying to get this song up and go going because they just trying to introduce me as a new artist. And then we'll go on from there with my second single. Right, right. Well, yeah, you need to take the time and work it. Make sure it works correctly. And it sounds like you got a lot of people after you, too. Three three labels you mentioned, right? Yeah, 